Alright guys, here we are to react to the trailer for the movie The Midnight Man. Evil comes at midnight. I've heard that. Uh, so what do you think this is going to be? Do you, like, for some, some reason, my, my, my mind immediately went to like, ah, it's a Slender Man ripoff. <laughs> like, the Midnight Man. Um, Who's in it? Anybody? Emily? But seeing nothing but a woman holding a candle and a clawed hand, uh, it could be anything. That's either that they're trying to create some new dumb fucking monster for some new horror series. That's vaguely werewolfy, but Midnight Man feels more like a demon-y. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. Only go there at midnight. Let's man. check it out. Why would you ever play this game? Um, I'd like to be the midnight. I'd like to play as the midnight man. That feels like the good. Halfway through, I started to think like, you know, I've seen a lot. I've seen a lot of these things. It must be great to be the the, the thing, <laughs> the monster, right? To have the rules and like try to play the game by like, more kids. Fuck yeah! This is awesome. Because what the fuck? It seems like there's just, it's like, all right, do this and you won't die. But they didn't address, like, and if you win, you get a wish. Or, like, you know, something. I know, something. There, there should be some reason some to play. Some reason to play. This is not a game for children. Yeah. No, it's very, very strange. Um, and, it, and it seems like he can, you know, uh, not necessarily cheat, but he, he can play. Because uh, he he's, you know, throws water on the salt circle and, like, you know, gets that bitch. Um yeah, Robert he, England, that's cool. Does he scare her to make the water go, or he's put, or is he like, like literally pushed? No, it the looked water. like he like swatted yeah, it at her. Yeah, seemed like he did something. I don't know. I, uh, I, I kind of like this. I think. I don't know why. Well, no, I think it seems like the production yeah. value seems high. It seems uh, like has good people well, in it. And nothing in, in in like usually a horror movie trailer has at least one moment where I go, uh oh, fuck this or whatever the fuck. And this didn't really have that. My my biggest thing, of course, is just the why would you play against something that uses your biggest fears and then kills you? Because humanity is doomed to uh, failure. And, I guess I guess if you could put it on the gram or or Snapchat it. <laughs> if you could Instagram chat your stuff or whatever. Damn. Yeah, he like shatters a pot full of water right? and it just comes at you. I real so like. At, at, at first, that was dope. Oh, we just draw a circle. Okay, I'm protected. Good. Okay, candle. Got to relight it. For some reason, using matches and not a lighter. I don't know. Whatever. We like to. We're playing this game on hard mode, guys. Whatever the fuck. Right. Uh -huh. And then like the little bit of water is going through. So I'm like, oh shit. Now we're on to. Oh, he can just like fucking splash. Oh, well, why doesn't he just fucking take a broom and break the circle and be like, all right, fuck. Yeah. Sorry. And you she lose. like. Right she out, sees right? the water coming, so she like is like dumping. She's playing. Dirt. She's like playing. But her hand yeah. is outside the circle. Couldn't yeah. you just grab her hand and pull her out right yeah, then? Yeah. yeah. How three-dimensional is this And circle? when we see the 1950s thing with the kids playing in the attic, the girl that gets dragged away, her, she hand, did? her hand breaks the circle. So I wonder if the other kids mm. died, too. Well, those are the younger versions of, 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 of the people in the trailer. Do you think that? Yeah, look at them. And he says, like, we used to play when we were a kid or whatever, right? Wait, which, ki which one's in the trailer? I th of the ones that are playing later? I, I thought so. Look at them. No, it can't isn't be. That, that, that's a different kid with the same looking face or whatever? Though? Only if math has anything oh, to do with man. it. That was 1953. Oh, and this takes place now? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. I think that the old, old lady was one of the, was one of the okay, people. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's confusing. Uh, I wasn't that confused. <laughs> I think she's the only one that survives. Because at one point, it looked like out of the closet, the, the I think the Midnight Man goes like... Shh. Like, yeah. like, don't tell anybody, bitch. I'm coming for you. I like, like it. Well, I'm coming for like the new kids now, or whatever. Fuck your, yeah. Your grandkids are mine. So she was the one of the two, and then Robert England was the dude. You think, or no? I don't know. That's interesting. Now, um, um, but I like Robert England, and he's in a, a, such a, a nice mix of of great to horrible shit. He'll do anything. Seemingly, he will yeah. do anything. Uh, and I imagine because he, you know, he's probably very well paid. They're like, yeah, you give me a million dollars, I'll do whatever you want, kid. No, there's a good like two-way street relationship with that now. It's like Robert De Niro. Where it's like, yeah, I'll be in your movie. I don't have nothing else to do. Oh, and you're fine. not trying to prove anything anymore. Yeah, you're, like, okay. you're like, I'm the best. I have an Oscar. Yeah. I'm fucking doing whatever I want. I'm Freddy. Yeah. No, I, 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 I want to see this. This is one of the few horror movie trailers where they show, like, quote-unquote, the monster several times, and, and I don't immediately say, you shouldn't have shown me that, don't show me that. Oh, no, that's like, a creepy monster. What they're showing me makes me, like, want... And it seems and to be a shape shifter and stuff. Yeah, his yeah. appearance. So, so, but his static form is, is, is gangly and creepy. Yeah. And his, like, like, faceless face. I like, like, like one of the most uh, stock, like, horror things, like, in my own head as a kid, I, I, I used to describe as, like, it's like a weird skeleton with, like, tight, like, like leather, like... like like wrapped around it or whatever, uh -huh. and, and that's what this looks like. It's a very thin waist and like big fingers and this big like yeah. weird thing. And I'm like, ah, that's terrifying. Wonderful, <laughs> something like that. Um, I'm thumbing this up because I want to see it. Agreed. I I do want to see it. I, if not, kids die. If not, just to find out why would you play? 
Like there has to be a like you, when you win, you get this, or you live forever. You'll get your true love. Like something has to happen. Why would you play this yeah, game? Yeah, I think that the kids were playing it, and but the game is still on because this one old lady is the one kid who's not dead, or maybe Robert England's not dead, or whatever, right? Uh -huh. And it's like continuing, and they get wrapped up in it like accidentally, or they they just light a candle to see, and that's the candle for the game, or something like this. They just accidentally get into it, or whatever. But I hope I know why the kids played back in the day, right? Something. What was the appeal? Probably just like a Ouija board, like kids are dumb, like, oh, say Bloody Mary in the, in the mirror, something like that. I guess, yeah, people have all said that, and, and, and there's no upside, well, it's only die. <laughs> and if it's a continuation of, of, like, the very young children's, it makes more sense, right? Because you would, you know, you would hope these, like, 20-year-olds can engage in a pro-con analysis and decide it's not worth playing the game or whatever. Because it's like, only a the game. Young kids should play. Like, even if you don't believe yeah. it's everything, it's like, oh, it's creepy, blah, blah. It's not a game unless there's an actual game to it. Like a Ouija board, right? Yeah. It's, like, it's like a weird, dumb thing we do to be like, oh, you're scared. No, you're moving it. Stop moving it. Ooh, I'm a kid. I'm an idiot. It. Yeah, and it's weird, like, coming out of the blood. I'm like, what the hell is that? Yeah, that that was the one thing, or, like, there's a few maybe, but there's, there's little things where I'm like, is that from a dream? Is that a dream sequence? Is this real life? How, you know, Everything is so heavy into the dream yeah. sequences What kind now, of powers it's does hard the, to really guess. do things have? Yeah. But, yeah, no, I, I do think this is good. I would like to see this. And for The, the Midnight Man for, for a goofy title. It is. I was just going to say, like, honestly, uh, the biggest differential between the title and, like, the, like, legitness of the thing. Because the Midnight Man sounds like the Bye Bye Man, which sounds like the other shit and all the things everyone makes fun of. They might have think that I didn't see it. The Jessica Biel one I was trying stuff. to think of was called The Tall Man. The Tall Man. Okay. Was, it, was that the name of the movie? That was the name of the movie. Okay. There's a lot of the something man floating around, and yeah. it's a lot of, like, ugh. All that stuff, but... Uh, well, yeah, you like gotta ape as much off of things as you can to try to get some, like, you know, someone walks in, oh, the Midnight Man, I think I heard of that. That was one they were kids yeah. were killing themselves no, in the woods. Like, exactly. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta cash in your Slender Man money or whatever it is now. All right, um, guys, so let us know in the comments below what you think about this. Don't die in a fire, and we will see you next time. Did I question I care about you? And did I question I care about you?